Hey, this is Argo, and in this short video, I wanna talk about the six skills that every strategic account manager should have. So we've recently done some research at Rain Group around successful, what successful organizations and strategic account management do differently. And one of the things that we studied was what are the skill sets that individual account managers and strategic account managers in those organizations have? Now, we found that there are typically six skills which um, either an individual account manager has to some degree or an account team has. They are the technical expert, the relationship lead, the collaborator, the results driver, the innovator, and the project manager. So the technical expert, as the name implies, is the person who knows the technical detail. Uh, maybe they come from an engineering background, maybe they're a real subject matter expert, but they are someone who's on the account team essentially because of their technical expertise. They can answer the hard questions, they can provide the hard data, and that's their role on the team. The relationship lead, is the person who manages and owns the relationship externally. So they are the person who typically connects and, and, and builds relationships with various people on the buying side um, in the buying center. The collaborator is like the relationship lead, the person who builds relationships, but it's more internal. So this is the person who rallies the resources, builds the team, gets everything together, uh, makes sure that internally everything is set up for success. The results driver is kind of like the entrepreneur. Uh, it's the person who's looking for results. It's the person who's pushing things along. It's the person who will say things like, you know, hey, let's put a firm objective on this. How much money do we, how much revenue do we want to generate with this client in the next 12, 48 months, whatever it is. The innovator is the one that comes out with the left field ideas, right? The creative one, uh, the person who has innovative approaches and ideas and contributes those to the team and to the buyer. And then finally, the project manager is the person um, who project manages everything. Uh, it's the person who makes sure that things get done on time, on budget, when they need to be um, truly, truly um, you know, pulling everything together. Now, I already told you that what we did essentially was we, we looked at organizations that are more successful at doing this versus others. And what we found was really, really interesting. Across both organization types, so the ones that are very successful and the ones that aren't, these six roles exist. These six roles exist, they are filled in on account teams, but the emphasis is radically different. For top performers, they, the top three skill sets are, number one, the project manager, number two, the innovator, and number three, the results driver. Project manager, innovator, results driver. That's what the top performing sales organizations or the top performing organizations in strategic account management focus on most. In the rest category, so those that are not at all um, or are not as successful as these, these high performing organizations, the number three skill sets that are, um, that, are, that are displayed are the technical expert, the relationship lead, and the collaborator. So all six are the same across both data sets, but the relationship is exactly the opposite. The order in which they are displayed and valued and put forth is the exact inverse. I'll put a link to a blog post explaining some more of the research down here. If you like this, um, subscribe to my YouTube channel about, you know, I always share sales tips, B2B sales tips, things about account management, sales management, coaching, you know, giving these handy little sales tips, talking about things like, you know, which questions to ask, how to overcome objections, how to negotiate better, how to sell better. If you like that kind of stuff, if you're into that, then subscribe to my channel and I'll see you on the next video.